So recently, Google did a little experiment, as they're calling it, and they blocked a lot of users from using Adblock in order to watch YouTube videos. And I failed to realize, and this is kind of ridiculous considering how much I'm on YouTube, like I've never used an ad blocker. Um, I'm not kidding. I didn't realize that pretty much everyone on planet Earth uses an ad blocker when watching YouTube. Now, originally when I saw this on Twitter, this came up that uh, Google's no longer allowing it. I pretty much thought nothing of it. And then as a s extremely small YouTuber, I noticed my revenue change and holy crap, it it's really ridiculous. So I just wanna show you the change in revenue that I've had and just my little thoughts on the whole ad block experiment stuff. And yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so first let's just take a little uh, sampling beforehand. So I got approved for monetization right around here, April 3rd or April 4th. And this is what we're seeing right here for the entire month of April, okay? So $33.58, you can see, you know, typically there's peaks and valleys, but I'm averaging around a dollar a day, right? So nothing to write home about. I don't get that many views. Most of my videos get 100 to 300 views and some of my more well-off ones get like a thousand maybe two thousand i think the best one i have right now is around three thousand which is just a review on remote task so i don't get that many views at all and you know i was thinking this is pretty typical i i think a dollar a day for how little of views i get is pretty good honestly i i don't have a huge channel if i scaled it up you know, if I was making 10 times the amount of views, like 10,000 views per video, and I was getting $300 a month, I think that would actually be pretty fair, reasonable, and would suit my expectations. So let's change this and just do the month of May. Okay, so it's May 16th, so this is half the month. So remember, the month of April was $33.58. Ready? Here's May. May is already beating that, and it's only halfway through the month. $42. But let's take a look at just the last week alone. So you can see in the beginning of May, look, 82 cents, $1.42, $1.20, $1. $1.89.98. So the first six days, I was earning an average of less than a dollar a day. So if you really want to do it the ad block experiment way, you're probably looking at around these May 9th, May 10th. So May 9th, 286. 452, 422, 503, 359, 565, and then the highest by a large margin, $6.55. I promise you, I am not making any videos here that have a crap ton of views. You see, the top earning content for May is this I worked on remote tests for five hours straight. It gave me $12. It only has like a thousand views. Like for me, $12 for a thousand views is absolutely insane and it just goes to show that this ad block uh is taking away a huge chunk of revenue from youtubers now look look before you chastise me uh, i'm all for ad blockers okay like i fully understand first of all like i'm a really small youtuber it's not like i make a living off doing this you know i, I hope to get like a hundred dollars every three months it's a nice little pocket change for doing these small you know not that difficult video but I fully understand that like the ads can be really intrusive and if you have someone like me who makes a video at least eight minutes long you bet your butt that i'm going to put a mid roll at like four minutes just so i can try and make as much money as possible but that being said it's like i realize ads are intrusive so it's going to be really interesting to see how long google uh continues this experiment i know what they're trying to do they're trying to convert people to use youtube premium because not only will they get upfront revenue revenue for YouTube Premium, I, I don't know how much it is. I think it's it's cheap. It's like three or four dollars a month, I think, at least when I last time I saw it like four years ago. But they probably want to get the upfront revenue and then they want to pay the workers less. They say, Oh, here's your YouTube premium pool fund or whatever. So it's a it'd be a win-win if they got everyone on YouTube premium. And you know, I don't really think Google makes much more money by disabling ad block even though you know i just showed you my revenue stream has gone up almost four to five times uh daily because of this experiment you know 
I don't think it's going to last long anyway, and I don't think it's honestly making the parent company, Google, that much more money. So I think they're just tinkering with a little bit. I truly believe, even though Google is a pretty evil company sometimes, I truly believe that they are experimenting. I, I don't think it's going to last past the end of the month. Now, look, selfishly, of course, it's like I feel like I have to like pump out content now like every single day just so I can like harness in some of this money. I mean, even a video I did yesterday, which is only at 100 views, uh, Typically for something like that, I would be getting like five to 10 cents. And even that got 45 cents, four times more than what I was expecting. It's crazy. Like I'm averaging like a penny of view, which doesn't sound like a lot, but trust me for like YouTube videos. And for me who only has 7,500 subscribers, uh, a penny of view is amazing. If I got a penny of view for the rest of my life, you bet your ass I'm like hell bent on making content and becoming a YouTuber full time. But Nonetheless, just wanted to show uh, what's going on. So, hey, if this if they somehow permanently disable ad block, maybe I'll become a YouTuber full time or pump out videos like three videos a day or something crazy. So, you know, just wanted to give my uh, perspective, thought it was very interesting. And, uh, you know, if you're somehow stumbling across this channel and you don't know what I do, it's called Road to Retire and I just do a bunch of side hustles to try and retire early. Pretty self-explanatory, right? So if you're into side hustles and trying to retire early, dividend income, stuff like that, you can feel free to subscribe. Otherwise, hope you enjoy the video and I'll see y'all in the next one. See ya.